It's time for the Matt LeCroy Show on Fox Sports 1460. Brought to you by the Holiday Inn Middletown. Now with today's show, here's Terry Byram. Here with Senators manager Matt LeCroy on game four of a four-game series with the Erie Sioux Wolves. This morning, Matt, you had a bunch of kids out on the field, a couple of different sessions for annual baseball camp. What's it like being able to interact with some of the, the youngest players out there? Oh, it's fun. I mean, you know, the kids are excited. It's, uh, I know their little leagues have up and started and gone, and, and a lot of them are playing all-stars. But, you know, it's a chance for us to give back. Uh, a lot of kids that were eager, you know, it gives them, give them some little pointers that they can take home for the, for the rest of the summer to work on. But it was a lot of fun. So a couple of the players and a couple of coaches are out there helping out. So, uh, you know, it's always fun. You know, my son was out there with him and, and a lot of kids that I recognize that come to the game. So, you know, it's just a chance for us to, to give back to kids, to teach them what we know. Obviously a pretty hot one this morning. It was a hot one last night. What does the heat and humidity that we're now running into this week uh, do to the team, both mentally and physically? Well, I think you just got to be, uh, you make sure you're hydrated. Uh, you know, we back off. The work somewhat, you know, somewhat uh, to keep it a little bit shorter so they come in and, and stay hydrated and be cooled off. But uh, a lot of them like it hot. You know, a lot of Dominican players, you know, they're used to the heat and, and uh, guys from the south. So uh, it's a lot better than being cold, I can tell you that. But, uh, you know, our trainers do, a, you know, they do a good job of keeping everybody, all the electrolytes and all that kind of stuff to keep them hydrated. So uh, they're, they're ready. I mean, just kind of back off the work. Now, looking at tonight, here with this fourth game of the series against the Seawolves, looking for the series win, Mapes goes to the mound. What can we expect tonight? Well, hopefully he, he's, he'll do what he's done all year, pound the strike zone, uh, establish inside and mix in their off speed. So this will be a big game for us. You know, we, uh, we, we swept a doubleheader, and then they, they beat up on us pretty good last night. And uh, hopefully we can come out and win and, and take that series and hopefully some momentum going into uh, the Akron series, who's playing pretty well, and have a good three days off. Now, you're talking about the All-Star break, obviously the All-Star game in Akron. We have a few All-Stars. What, uh, what does it do for the guys that are going out there to the game to be able to go out and, and show off their skills and, and get that recognition? Well, I think they, they all will, you know, all will deserve to that honor. Uh, they deserve to go. And, you know, for me, a uh, selfish side of it, I wish they had the time off. Uh, but uh, for them, I know that's a chance for them to go out and have a little fun playing and, and uh, actually showcase some more of their talent and abilities for somebody to see. And, and uh, But they deserve it. Uh, you know, they're, we're going to be in uh, Altoona after the break, so they'll have a short trip up, and uh, hopefully they'll be ready to go. Now, with the guys that aren't going to Akron, obviously they do have those few days off, which is which is how you like it. Mm -hmm. How important is that at this stage of this the season to get a few days to recharge? And, and what do you leave the guys with as they they kind of leave the team for a few days? Well, one thing is uh, don't do nothing stupid. You know, a lot of times with All Star breaks, they they tend to go to the beach or. You know, they always somebody comes back with something wrong with their feet, you know, cut on glass or something stupid. So hopefully they'll be smart about their break and, and, and kind of step away from the game and mentally be uh, prepared to for that second half push. You know, we put ourselves in a good spot to compete for something. Hopefully they'll all uh, get their rest and come back ready to go. Thanks a lot, Matt. You got it.